What's up everybody and welcome back to some more Star Drive 2. So I made some changes between last week and this week. First off I'm moving my fleet over to uh, Drellic because we're building another ship there that's not our fuel barge. It's another another fighting ship so I may, may as well send to Drellic. Also we're building a whole bunch of Crescents, a whole bunch of Corvettes so we can actually have a decent fleet. And I did, then I did some reorganizing with labor and farmers and got us up to a positive without really messing with the tax, ra tax rate too much. So, anywho, whoop. That's just what I've been doing. So, we're popping out these little Corvettes. They're for free. And hopefully they will do exactly what we need them to do. Are you coming? You're not coming. Come on. Get over here. Hello, pirates and let the fleets come together here. Pirates. Go here. We'll be fine. Plasma fuel cells. Ah, yes! Our plasma tech is done. Beautiful. So we have 33% more fuel capacity. We have defensive flares that we can add on, which is awesome. And plasma cannons, which does a decent amount of damage over time. It's good against, like, shields. Or organic components. It's a good counter to organic components, which is right here. Really good counter to that. Let's see, so... Oh, and I uh, reduced our research a little bit so we could get some more production going. To get those ships out faster. So I guess we'll work on particle fusion next. I want to get the experimental stuff going, because that's where we're going to pick up our assimilator bonus is going to be on top of the unique techs. But that's going to take a little bit of time. What is that? They're hauling away some troops. They are a little hurt here, and I would love to intervene. Oh, yes! I also built a construction ship. Come over here. I'll actually just store you right here for now. But I'm going to send that construction ship. It's going to go over here to this gas giant mockery. And it's going to make a fueling station, so we can go from here to Mockery to probably right here is where I bet they have one. Right, let's take care of these pirates. Bye. Didn't even hurt us. That's all you want to see. Alright, go match up. Meet up with the fuel barge. Are you... You're still making them. We are at... Six Corvettes. Out of quite a few more being built. Okay. We'll wait for the fleets to come back together, and then we should be able to go over there and hopefully beat them down. If they have a star base, that's going to be a problem. Uh, but I might have to do this one all by my lonesome. Alright, the Crescent got finished. One fleet. It'll, it is a 25 command point fleet versus a 18, an 18 command point fleet. So I'm feeling good. I feel like we're going to get there. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven cruisers, six of which are actually combat vessels. They have three, four, five, six. They have seven cruisers, but they only have four Corvettes, and we have a whole bunch. Nine, ten Corvettes. And we have a frigate as well, so I'm feeling good about it. We're going to have to make sure we single out which one is our fuel barge and get him out of there, because he can't fight. What's up? There's a fleet over there? Okay. I'm not too concerned. Like, I am and I'm not. Fusion power, so better. Better fusion power. Fusion engines, so faster ships, and fusion beam, which is just awesome for fighters. So, uh, let's go into this stuff next. Get some pulse cannons and mass drivers. And. There it is. Ooh, six more Corvettes. We're actually going to get there before the Corvettes. Hopefully before they have a starbase up and running. If they have a starbase, that's just complete shenanigans. They do not. Let's do it. 
Or Fuel Barge needs to GTFO. I think I'll put the Fuel Barge up front just because it can take some damage. This is probably the Fuel Barge. Yeah, that's the Fuel Barge. Alright. So we can sit up front if it gets shot a little bit. I'm not too concerned. Otherwise, it's not a bad formation to be in. Actually. Compared to their formation. We'll see. Begin, slow-mo. You guys immediately go for that. And you can't do anything, so you can just go ahead and retreat. Uh, actually, hang on. Whoop! Hold up. Don't go get yourself killed. Don't go get yourself killed. All right. Real time. Slow down. Go that way. So, did we draw fire? I think we did. Looks like we drew fire with the fuel barge, and that's fine. Okay. Corvettes need to go intercept. Go, go, go! Oh my goodness, there you go, there you go, holy cow! Drop him! Drop him right now! If we lose Corvettes, I'm not overly concerned. Drop him! Okay, we tore through a good portion of him. And we tore up his, his little booty as well. Great. And just keep firing, keep doing damage. That's all I ask of you guys. Okay. Get moving. Get out of there. Let them kill some of their Corvettes too. I mean, they're, they're a danger. Power to the engines. Make sure you get moving. As I, as I understand, our Corvettes are basically toast, but they've done what they needed to do. And control group them. Okay, the UFS Duffeldorf should be completely toast. Yeah, all of our Corvettes are just getting wrecked. But again, that's, that's okay, that's what they're there for. You know, I, I got them because I wanted to make sure that uh, that they took the hits. They took the damage. You're actually hitting this guy. So are you. You are at risk for dying. Burn! Power to engines! Please do not get hit. Please do not die, I should say. Oh, not yet. Let's flip you around. Whoop! Not on the engines, please. Not on the engines. Uh-oh. 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 Spinning out of control. Oh, man. Oh, come on. Get the, the Arizona. Get the Arizona. You have a com- Ah, friendly territory combat. Good. Man, the Arizona is just surviving. You guys are aiming for that. I'd rather you hit this guy, truth be told. Okay, the Arizona's gonna die here very soon. It is toast. Little lasers can aim at the UFS Rome. We do not need the mass drivers to be aiming at a quick target. That would be very bad for us. Can you turn around? You can turn around. You should be firing. You weren't firing. That's not a good thing. Now this is probably approaching best case scenario. They are almost out of ammo. We're doing great on ammo. So we're basically just going to attrition them to death is what's happening here. We are attritioning them to death. Their left side, so it's this side that's getting real hammered. Whoop. Show them the other side. There you go. Show them that side. Where are you? You're just like, whee! Oh my goodness. That, that's terrible. That is terrible. We, our pike might survive this. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. It's trying. It's 
Oh my goodness. Come on. Punch through the front here. Front and the back there. We've mostly got them. I don't know if any of them have retreated or not. I'm not sure. Let's, let's show them your other side. Your left side. That's the side that can still take damage. Show them that side. You're hurting, but you should be fine. I think we've got this. I think all those Corvettes did enough damage in the initial burst that we're actually going to be okay here. Boom, there goes that. Plus, our fuel barge took some damage, and that's not a bad thing either. Because it's already gone, so it's fine. Nice! A mass driver connected. Good stuff. Front of that one's almost dead. We're hitting the center a little bit. Yeah, we've got him. Alright. Like hidden buttons over here. Whoop! <laughs> Those mass drivers miss so much, but they're so strong. You can even, like, you can see the impacts. I love that. The ships literally move from the impacts. There we go. That's how we survived. Not bad. I'm actually a little surprised that the Pike survived the whole ordeal, but... Yeah, Silver Star of Valor. Good stuff. Alright. Hopefully I just destroyed their entire fleet. I doubt it. But, we can dream, you know, we can dream. Okay, do not do automatic ground battles, ever. They still haven't fixed it. It's complete trash. You are going to have to move. Put you over here, here, start moving these guys. Alright, and shielding. Hello, move up, shield, move up. Shield. Shield. That should be plenty. But I'll put you here and put you there. You are right in range already. Well, thank you. Right in range. I do appreciate it. And you. There you go. Ta-da! Fire! Nice and easy. Hey, that works for me. Fall back one. Can you hit from here? You cannot. Oh, you could hit that. Ah, that's not cool. Alright. We took some damage, but that's okay. We're fine. Overwhelming victories. We reclaim the planet that is rightfully ours. Now I'm curious if we can go ahead and take out the other fleet. 
I don't want military antenna. I can already get it myself. Ah, good. They're all Draylockians. Up and going. Fleet. Their fleet. Their fleet's still over here. They come in this way still. I'd love to to meet them in space. They are! Hello! Go this way. Hey, 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 hey. Get dunked! And actually, you don't have any construction. Whoops! Starbase! Immediately, Starbase. Imperial Bank, Research Lab, VRNet, University, Antenna. Alright. And trade goods, of course. All right, well, that's been dealt with. We actually need to make quite a few, uh, quite a few more Corvettes. We've lost all of them. We're down to three Corvettes is what we have. Three Corvettes. All right. Get a military antenna going over here. And I want a whole bunch of colony ships. I want to start going nuts on colony ships. Let's take you guys. Uh, you just sit there for now. Sit there and repair. VR net at Drellock. Good stuff. A little bit more to fix up and then we'll be fine. Imperial bank. Plastic laser. Aha! Pulse cannons! Good stuff. That's one of my favorite ones. They can disable ships, mass drivers, and rail rifles. Probably won't be using the rail rifles, but they can be very powerful. Alright, let's go ahead and... Oh, we could get shields, though. Ooh. Mandatory service. No, I don't know. We've got a lot of good ones right now. I don't know. Button become one. Good, Riz done's good. They're almost fixed. Only 6% per turn, which is not great. Alright, go ahead and go meet up. It'll automatically repair, which is nice. Search lab and VR net. What's up? And I had just left. Seriously? I just left. Gosh dang it. Are you kidding me right now? What? Just, just, just stop. You're just screwing yourself. Just stop. Get out of here. You don't stand a chance, humans. Just get out of here. You're trash. Oh, uh, yeah. We should be good. Ah! I hate the left click move. I hate it so much. It is just so frustrating. Actually, we'll put you there instead. We'll do it this way. Left click move is just like the worst thing. I, I just really hate it in video games and this has it and I just hate that so much. Okay, we hit him? No, but apparently he can hit us. Take him out. No chance. 
Absolutely no chance for the pathetic little humans. Okay. Nope. And nope. Well, this guy's probably dead, but, you know, so be it. He can still go out with guns blazing. He just about did it all by himself, too. Not bad. But So he's not dead. He's just going to get pretty seriously injured. That's okay. Bye-bye. And done. Alright, didn't even lose a single soldier. Not one. Just stop wasting your time. Unless you have Xeno Assimilation, which I do not know whether or not you do, but if you don't, then it's just... You're wasting my time. You're wasting your time. You just need to stop. It's not worth it. Unless you seriously have Xeno Assimilation, and even then... Even then. Start working on that star base again. Ah, uh, it's so frustrating. Lost all that production. Garnet, resequencer, soil enrichment, yeah, fleet academy. Okay. Everything's going again. But like I was about to do, how about we go this way? We have better fuel efficiency now. Plus, we have a fuel barge. It might just be enough. I don't know. But I'll, I'll send the construction ship out to Mockery. And I will attempt to actually make some progress. Military antenna. Need to make sure we get the antennas set up, too. Actually. Acryx is building another plastic laser. Goodness. Drell. We got that's Drell 1. So Drell 2. It's a military antenna. Drell 4 is fine because they're building colony ships. Whoop. I just went to some some planet. Randall. Okay, Drellic. You also need a military antenna. Randall 2. Okay, and then Riz done. Military antenna. Okay. We have a lot of food right now. But food means money, so I'm okay with this. All in a ship. Petar. We want... Uh, diamondite. So Tether is... I, I did some looking around. Tether is probably like the single greatest system that we have access to. It's kind of unfortunate that there is so much chaos out here, so much danger out here. Uh, but Tether has Diamondite, Trilithium, and Nanocash. Like, holy cow. The Diamondite in particular will give us a lot of money. So, it's one that we want, and we need to be able to hold on to it, so I don't know if we should be doing that right now. But we could do t is go here, actually. Aha! Recruiting station! Plus one experience level to all capital ships built in Acarax. Good stuff. We'll actually wait for that one last ship. Eh. Yeah, I guess we should. Just to be safe, we should. Did you get there? You did get there. Great. Must have colonized down there. Oh, yes, subspace station. Refueling station for me, please. Another rift. Oh, where? Re why? Why off the map? Does it have to be off the map? 
Well, you have your... You have your star base, so... Should be fine. We need a lot of Corvettes. So... Start making Corvettes. Probably won't even be able to make that many, honestly. Big Academy Military Antenna, and then VR Net way down here. Three turns for a single Corvette. Oh, man. All right, well, next episode, we'll deal with it, because that's it for this one, guys. So, as always, thank you for watching, and I will see you next time with some more Star Drive 2. DFTBA.